The International Code of Zoological Nomenclature is a widely accepted convention in zoology that rules the formal scientific naming of organisms treated as animals. The rules principally regulate how names are correctly established in the frame of binomial nomenclature, which name must be used in case of name conflicts, how scientific literature must cite names. Zoological nomenclature is independent of other systems of nomenclature, for example botanical nomenclature. This implies that animals can have the same generic names as plants. The rules and recommendations have one fundamental aim, to provide the maximum universality and continuity in the naming of all animals, except where taxonomic judgment dictates otherwise. The code is meant to guide only the nomenclature of animals, while leaving zoologists freedom in classifying new taxa. In other words, whether a species itself is or is not a recognized entity is a subjective decision, but what name should be applied to it is not. The code applies only to the latter, not to the former. A new animal name published without adherence to the code may be deemed simply unavailable if it fails to meet certain criteria, or fall entirely out of the province of science. The rules in the code determine what names are valid for any taxon in the family group, genus group, and species group. It has additional provisions on names in higher ranks. The code recognizes no case law. Any dispute is decided first by applying the code directly, and not by reference to precedent. The code is also retroactive or retrospective, which means that previous editions of the code, or previous other rules and conventions have no force anymore today, and the nomenclature acts published back in the old times must be evaluated only under the present edition of the code. In cases of disputes concerning the interpretation, the usual procedure is to consult the French code. Lastly, a case can be brought to the Commission who has the right to publish a final decision.